Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the Rogue Master firmware on the Flipper Zero. We're going to be installing this step by step. I'll show you guys where to get it, how to install it, and we'll do this walkthrough together. So if you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Please like, subscribe, and share. And if you guys aren't familiar with a Flipper Zero, it's right here. Let me get it. This is, we're going to be plugging this into a laptop in a, in a minute, and we're going to be flashing this with the Rogue Master. So if you guys are ready for the video, let's jump onto the desktop and have some fun. All right, guys, so here is my desktop. So what I'm actually doing is remoting into a computer that is right next to me. That's a laptop and this is still not plugged in. So we're going to see that in a second. So before we actually go ahead and do anything, let's open up the Q flipper. And it says connect your flipper. So let me connect that right now. I'm connecting that to my laptop. And you can see here there, there's no updates. I did update it already. You may have an update to do. You can go ahead and update that right now. And I'm going to leave this open just so you guys can see something. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and come back here. So you can go ahead and go to uh, github.com slash rogue master. And you can see the Flipper Zero, let me make this a little larger, so it's a little bigger. The Flipper Zero firmware with plugins. So once you come here, this is the link right here, right? So on the releases, we have this uh, Rogue Master RM0912, et cetera, et cetera, whatever. That's the latest and greatest. So if we open up this in a new tab, you can see here, is the latest firmware. And this is what, from released la uh, this week, this last week. So install GitHub version. So if we go ahead and open up the web installer, and this is the easiest way this, to do this. So you can go ahead and open this up in a new browser. And obviously I'm using, I'm using Firefox. Why isn't this, uh, that's weird. Let's copy that. Let's see what's supported. The Firefox would be supported. Hmm. Guess not. All right, so that's fine. Let's go ahead and use uh, Google Chrome. All right, let's go ahead and uh, use that. It's fine. Let's go ahead and paste that into Google Chrome. So it says connect. So if we hit connect, we hit here, and you're going to get this little pop up with the flipper connect. I wanted to do this on purpose. So connect. Uh, can't connect the flipper. The reason being is because you have to close this application first, the Qs flipper, make sure this is closed. Once we close this, we try again, and we should see it come in here. All right, let's make this larger. And my firmware that I'm running currently is 0 0.91.4. So you can see here, the latest one is 0 0.90.2. And this is the flipper, excuse me, this is the Rogue Master application or firmware that we're going to install, right? So we can just go ahead and hit install. And on my flipper right now, it's n nothing's happening yet. Nothing's happening yet. So it's just up, uh, updating the files, as you can see here. And this may take a few minutes. And if you guys want to get a flipper, right? If you guys want one, you, what you can do is just, while this is doing its thing, I'll go ahead and. Uh, Let's go ahead and do this really quick. And then open that. And I'm sure my big head's probably in the way, but let's go ahead and go ahead and do this. All right. So while this is doing its thing, let's come over here. We can go to uh, shop. Let's just go to Google. You can just do shop flipper zero. And I never had a problem. You know, I don't know if it's where I'm at in the world, but you can just go to uh, shop that flipper zero one. And what I have, obviously I have the silicone and I have the screen protector and I have the Wi-Fi board. Uh, the Wi-Fi board is, is right here. This little guy right here. And, you know, obviously I can probably make some videos later on on how to, you know, how to utilize that and how to install it and flash it and all that good stuff. But this is the flipper, you, you know, it's 100, 
in seventy dollars, one hundred sixty nine dollars. This is here in the U.S. I'm not sure, you know, how much it is or how to get it where you're at, but this is in the U.S. and it's usually very easy to get. So yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much that. So right now it says updating on my Flipper Zero. Obviously, I can't move it, but it just says updating, updating resources and uh, all that good stuff. So is that a date? Okay, that's fine. It's updating right now. So it's, it's going to go ahead and probably update it to the latest and greatest. Once this is done, it's just say successful. And uh, yeah, it's pretty much saying it right here on this on the screen. Pretty much saying the same exact thing, updating resources. So we'll give this a few minutes. And uh, yeah, so on the side note, you know, I just hit 40,000 subscribers. So I want to thank each and every one of you guys that hit that subscribe button. If you haven't yet, just hit that subscribe button. It's free. And you can also become a member. And, you know, for a small fee each month, it helps the channel, helps me put out these videos, helps me with my studio setup. Everything that I make on my little YouTube channel goes right back into YouTube. And like for my camera, my lights, my everything that I utilize for YouTube, you know, I don't really, you know, I don't go, I'm not buying a, you know, a Ferrari tomorrow. But um, yeah, so I really want to say thank you for, for all the support from everyone. And I do have some members, so thank you so much for becoming a member. And I'm super grateful and uh, thank you. So we'll give this a few moments. I'm not sure how long this will actually take. Uh, this is the first time I actually installed Rogue Master. So we're learning together. And I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say I did this before. I, I used to have Unleashed. I updated my uh, Flipper today. And the reason, why, the reason why I wanted to get the Rogue Master update is because there was a few cool tools and, and, and stuff like that that I wanted to mess with and tinker with and uh, yeah, do some, do some cool pen testing stuff. All right, so it says uh, firmware updated, success, like so I, I can just hit next. Okay, so now I do have, I do have, so you see it on the screen. What I want to do is I'm probably, let me go ahead and, uh, does, is there an updated version? All right, so let me go ahead and unplug this. I want to unplug this for a second. And I want to do all this and I want to open up my Q flipper, connect this back. And I'd rather do it on here. Let's go ahead and, uh, so if I come down, let me go back. Here, let me go to. I want to go ahead and go to settings and go all the way down to about. And you can see the model, hardware, firmware. You can see the firmware is 092. And yeah, so let's go ahead and see if. Uh, let's go ahead and go back really quick. I want to I want to test something really. Oh, ah, shoot. So uh, let's see. Whoops, not nah, about Bluetooth. Uh, system. I want to see something. Oh, why does it keep going to Bluetooth? Is it maybe it's under about? So So yeah, so I guess uh you hold this middle button down, you can change it. And you see like it has a whole bunch of uh right there, Rogue Master. Whoops, I lost that. Right there, Rogue Master. As you can see here, you can see that the Rogue Master firmware is installed. So yeah, that's pretty much concludes this video. Sorry about that little mix up. I was trying to get to here and I forgot uh, where exactly it was, but it's just hold down the middle button. You just hold down this here and I'll change it. You just hold it down and uh, so on and so forth. That, that's a cool one. Uh, whoops, not that. Ah, oh, geez. Just hold this down, hold it down, hold it down. I want to get back that, uh, that cool matrix looking thing. 
There we go. I want to stick with this one. This one looks pretty cool. All right. Thank you so much for viewing. I really hope this video is informative for you guys. If you have any questions, just hit me up and I will be more than happy to try to help you out. Thank you so much and check you later.